A family in Wa area, Kwale County, is demanding justice following the death of their kin at the hands of traffic police in Salama area, Makweni County. Mohammed Masood, who was a truck driver, is said to have died after he was allegedly hit with a blunt object by police officers manning a roadblock in Salama area following an altercation. The police have since denied the claims, saying that the deceased was running away from arrest when he fell into a ditch, sustaining injuries and later succumbed. Emily Chebet reports. Mohammed Masood's journey from Tororo in Tanzania headed to Mombasa was cut short at Salama area in Makweni County only for the family to be called to pick the body of their loved one. Mohammed's family blaming the traffic police officers for the death of their kin. So generally nilipofika katika kituo cha Salama niliweza kukutana na mdogo wa traffic traffic base akanieleza ati kijana alikuwa na ameshikwa na mofisazi wake Eh, sasa akitaka kuingizwa ndani akasema wezi ingia mpaka aeleze kampuni na hiyo ndiyo mipangilio yao ya kazi. Katika hiyo harakati atujui nini kilifanyika. Kwa narudi kutoka safari ambapo kuna driver wetu alianguka sije akafariki. So, tukafika hapo tukajaribu kulizia kama paka ndugu zake wakuje ndio tupewe body nini. Baada ndugu yake kuja tukaamua kwenda mochari. Ndio hapo ndio tukapata body in bruises. According to the family, the police officers hit their kin on the head with a blunt object after he was stopped by the officers and an argument arose between them. The hospital report confirming the same that he died due to head trauma caused by a blunt object. Tumeenda huko pamoja na daktari wa serikali. Postmortem imefanywa. Tumepewa report na tumeona kwamba huyu ndugu yangu alipasuka kichwa. But the police report has a different version, claiming that the driver was stopped by traffic officers at Salama roadblock, but instead he alighted and ran away. The report further says that he fell into a ditch and was immediately arrested by the officers. The police report says he later developed breathing problems and was rushed to hospital where he died on arrival. However, the hospital says he was already dead when he was brought to the facility. On 7th of August 2023, at around 8.30 a.m., we received a body in a police vehicle from the Sultan Ahmud police. The person had uh, multiple bruises on the left hand, and he also had uh, right and left scalp uh, uh, bleeding with subdural hematoma and hemorrhage. Uh, we also had uh, linear skull fractures noted on, on the head. The family is calling for further investigations into the mysterious death of 